I'm willing to give you the benefit of the doubt. But I'll warn you now. If you ever hurt Xander, then you'll be dealing with me after. Uh, right. <laughs> Great. I hope we can all get along. <laughs> oh, man. Did I really make the right choice of joining the music club with these guys? Hello everyone, my name is Duka Jung and welcome back to my channel and today we're back to another reaction field so today I'm I'm continuing to watch the music freaks and today I'm here to watch uh, episode 2 called Trust Issues so um, last time I have uh, watched uh, episode 1 so Today we're here to watch episode two, and also um just let you remind that um that um that I am um we watching um we watching this uh gacha series because um because the brand new episode is coming soon, and and also um I haven't watched it for a long time since the last episode has released for around three months. So um, right now is a better time to um, revisit all of the episodes so we can prepare for um, the brand new episode. So yeah, so today we're here to watch um, episode 2. So without further ado, let's watch it. You did what? Wait, hear me out. I know what you're thinking, but there's a reasonable explanation. You seriously ditched us yesterday to audition for the Music Freak Club? <laughs> oh, I can't wait to hear this. Look, it's Daisy. She told me that she loved singers and that I should try out for the competition, so <laughs> I agreed. <laughs> you joined the music competition for Daisy? Dude, you're so wet. <laughs> Scream it out to the whole school! That's it. Daisy told you to? So you said yes? What's next? Are you gonna strip down butt naked in front of everyone because she asked you to? Sip! <laughs> <laughs> Look, it's all part of my plan. Daisy said she would come and watch me practice during the rehearsals, which gives me a chance to get closer to her. And once I impress her with my singing, I can finally ask her out. Good, right? Seriously, dude? I wouldn't go through that much effort for a chick. I'll give you props, though. Liam, if I know anything about ladies, it's that they love a guy who can sing. Besides, it's called being romantic. Romantic? What's that? I've never heard of that word. Heh, <laughs> and that's why you've never had a girlfriend. Then what's your excuse, then? You've never even kissed a girl. I just can't believe you're gonna embarrass yourself on stage with those freaks. Just to ask a girl out. Hey, you think if I auditioned to sing, I could get Leah to like me? It can't be that hard. Listen, and I was like, baby, 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 oh, oh my I god. Baby, Great. Just a beaver. Don't you know, baby, and mine. I just realized I'm like music practice. See you guys next period. Yeah, see ya. Yo, he's singing the song from joining those music freaks just to impress Daisy. What's so impressive about it anyway? It's not like I had to embarrass myself on stage to get Zoe to like me. Then again, I could probably get any girl I wanted. Yeah, sure, dude. It has nothing to do with the fact that your parents are loaded. Or that your girlfriend's a gold digger. Okay, goddamn commercials. he has any ulterior motives? Embarrass us on stage in front of everybody? If that happens, I'll just boot him off stage with my foot. Simple. Then why don't we just boot him out now? Because, Xander, we're supposed to be giving him a chance. He... Uh, did I come at a bad time again? You're late. I thought I told you practice was at 12.30 sharp. Oh, right, my bad. You know what the line is like in the cafeteria. <laughs> uh huh. See what I mean? He can't even take rehearsals seriously. He probably won't even show up for the competition. 
Hey, I was only 10 minutes late today. Okay, I'm sorry for turning up late. I promise I won't do it again. Mm. Sounds like a load of crap to me. Ugh, he really hates my guts, huh? Well, the good news is I think I found the perfect beat for our performance. You guys want to hear it? <laughs> Obviously. DJ, hit that track. You got it. Sean. Nice! Now I can finally try making a guitar riff for this thing. And I can't wait to practice on my baby again. So, how do we go about making a song? Well, now that I've found the beat, I can play around with the melody a bit, add everyone's instruments into the mix, and then you can write the lyrics for the song. I'm usually the songwriter, so we can work on that together. Once we have a song written, you can practice your vocals with Sander on the piano. Him practice with me. I'm not going to waste my valuable time on him. Xander. <laughs> I thought you told me to take the competition seriously. I refuse to waste my time on you because I'm taking it seriously. I know you're only here for some other selfish reason rather than an actual passion. It's obvious that you haven't joined our club out of real interest. And for some reason, I'm the only one in this bloody club that seems to get it! Ah, uh, funnily enough, I actually do have a passion for music, and I love singing! You don't know anything about me! Guys, please stop. Then why have you talked down on us for so long? That's what I thought. <laughs> this the whole time can you blame him you and your friends have given both of us a difficult time of course he doesn't trust you but what do you suggest i do to get his trust back he's your boyfriend so you know him best I'm dating my stepbrother? Nani? <laughs> Wait, he's your stepbrother? Come on, dude. Have you not been in the same class with them since freshman year? And even if we weren't siblings, I'm not exactly his type. <laughs> yeah, he's gay. <laughs> you really don't know anything about your classmates. I guess not. And I guess that means practice is over. Well, this has certainly been productive. I better go find my boyfriend now. <laughs> See you guys. Oh, man! I wanted to show Jake my sick guitar skills today! You'll have plenty of opportunities to do that in the future, Millie. Hey, Jake. Can I talk to you for a sec? Oh, sure. Luke is Sanders' childhood friend, if I remember right. He seems like a really nice guy, and I think he trusts me. I'm sure he has nothing bad to say to me. I know that Xander is making it difficult for you to be in the club. He just needs more time to get used to you being around. But 
you have to understand where he's coming from. And not just him, Haley too. They're used to, no offense, people like you talking down on them. I know. And I'll even admit, I've been a real jerk to them both. I won't act like that again. I'm willing to give you the benefit of the doubt. But I'll warn you now. If you ever hurt Xander, then you'll be dealing with me after. Uh, right. <laughs> Great. I hope we can all get along. <laughs> oh, man. Did I really make the right choice of joining the music club with these guys? <sighs> just say I'm not exactly welcomed by a few of the members. Oh, that's a shame. Well, it might take them a while to warm up to you. I'm sure they'll treat you like family soon. Yeah, I doubt it. I just wish there was something I could do to show them that I do care about this band competition. Mm. Hey, I have an idea. How about you try to get them more support? What do you mean? I mean support from the students. Not many people know about the band competition and all, which I think is such a shame. If people were interested and were willing to watch you guys, I'm sure it'll make them happy. You're very likable, so I'm sure you'll do a great job convincing people. Y you think I'm likable? Of course you are. I like you, Jake. Whoa! She said she liked me! God! Thank you for letting me live so I can meet this angel! <laughs> uh, uh, sorry. Lost my train of thought there. I think that's a great idea, Daisy. I'll make sure everyone knows about this band competition. Just leave it to me. <laughs> We're all counting on you then. Oh, I better get to my student council meeting now. Uh, good luck, Jake. Not to toot my own horn, but... If anyone finds out that I'm the lead singer, I'm sure more people will be more interested. How do I go about telling them? I think I know just the girls for the job. Camera shows. God damn and then I told him that silver doesn't suit my skin tone. So he bought me the gold hoops as well. Oh, wow, that's clever. I'll have to use that on my dad next time. He works every time. Good morning, girls. Oh, good morning, Jake. Uh, morning to you too. Why are you looking at me like that? Well, you don't usually come up to us so casually just to say good morning to us. You clearly want something. I don't want anything. Well, maybe. I need everyone to know about this. The band competition? But why? Don't you know? I'm the lead singer. You're singing in a band? You heard right. <laughs> and I'm pretty good if I do say so myself. Wow, you can sing? That's hot. I'll come watch you perform, Jake. Oh, uh, thanks, Leah. Isn't this the competition that those music nerds are doing? Well, yes, but honestly, they're not half bad. And now that I'm in it, it has to be good. Yeah, I can't wait to watch you. You'll come and watch too, right, Zoe? I suppose. It sounds like fun. Does that mean you'll help me out and tell other people? I want all the support I can get. Oh, you can leave that to me. <laughs> Did 
done. No need to thank me, Jake. It's my pleasure. Hey! Good luck in the band competition, guys. Oh, uh, thanks? Who was that? A secret admirer, perhaps? Hey, Xander! I can't wait to hear you play on the piano for the competition. You'll be so amazing. Uh, thank you? Uh, Xander, what's going on? Why are people talking to us? I... I don't know. But I have a feeling Jake has something to do with this. Could you explain what's going on? <laughs> I think you should ask Jake. Jake, can we talk outside? Oh, sure. I'll be back in a minute, ladies. <laughs> <laughs> Why do I feel like I'm about to be told off by my parents? Care to explain why the music room is full of people? And why people are suddenly coming up to us about the competition. Well, you don't seem too happy about it. Well, the truth is, I wanted to try to make it up to you guys for being such a douche before. I know a lot of people give you slack about your club, so... You mean you and your goons? Uh, uh yeah. Well, I figured that I could try getting you guys more support. Our whole school wants to see us perform on stage. Really? Well, that really wasn't necessary. We don't need your charity. We are perfectly capable of winning the whole crown over without your help. But I suppose having the school's support at the competition will do us good. We could do with some encouragement on the day. I appreciate your effort. And I'm sorry for the way I've been acting. It was very childish of me. I'll give you a chance, but just one. Hey, thanks, Xander. Hey, the piano is not a toy. Get off of that right now. <laughs> <laughs> thanks, Jake for, you know, helping out. Oh, uh, yeah, no problem. It's nice to see so many people interested in our club for a change, especially how many girls there are. Yeah, I mean, can you blame them? You only have the most charming and attractive guy in school as your lead singer. Charming? You? I think you need a reality check. Well, you didn't deny that I'm handsome. Just, you are delusional. Come on, we have a competition to practice for. <laughs> yes, ma'am. Okay, that's episode two. Hello, everyone. Thank you so much for watching this episode of The Music Freaks. If you did enjoy the video and you'd like to support me to make more episodes of this series, then please give the like on the video for me and also hit that subscribe button. If you can't wait for the next episode, then make sure to follow me on Instagram for sneak peeks as well as my second account, Extra Rosie. This of course wouldn't have been possible without all of my amazingly talented voice actors, so please go and check them out in the description. Well, that's all from me. Stay tuned for the next episode. Bye guys! Okay guys, so um, that was episode 2 of the News of Week, so I... I, I want to talk about my um my personal thoughts about um about this episode um so so first of all um like like the part where Harry I'm um, saying like baby 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 oh that was actually um a song from Justin Bieber when he was younger he he uh, Justin Bieber had a song called baby when 
and I remember that when that song released, he was much younger, and I remember that's the first song I hear from Justin Bieber. And <laughs> and um and also um another thing is that um that I also like about uh the song that Sanders sing like I wanna see and in your side your bed. <laughs> I I love that one. And when I first time to watch this, I was a little bit, uh, surprised and shocked. To learn that um that Haley and Sander are are step siblings and, and at the same time that uh Sander is gay, I was I was shocked to hear this because I never expected something like that. But um. But yeah, guys. So, um, so that was um episode two of the News of Freaks. So, um, and also that's the end of um. <coughs> I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Sorry. Hello. Hello. <sighs> okay. I'm good. Okay, guys. I'm I'm good. I'm I'm okay. Okay. I have no COVID. Okay. I'm fine. I'm fine. Okay. Just I just feel like my 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 throat too dry, so that's why right. <laughs> you may f see my face like looks like I'm about to throw up something like that. I don't know, but yeah, guys. So um, so that was um episode two of the News Freaks, and um, and also that's the end of today's video. And I hope guys enjoy. If you please leave a like and share to friends. Also, if you guys want to see more. Uh, please subscribe my channel, click the bell button so you know when ha when I have new videos come out. And also, um, you guys want to uh, check out the news of feeds, a link will be in the description down below. I will leave a link to the playlist so you can watch all of the episodes on your own. And also, don't forget to uh, check out uh, Rosie Closey and subscribe to her. So, um... So next time we're going to um watch episode three. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I see you guys in the next video. Goodbye, guys. <laughs>